What's up guys? Welcome to another exciting episode of Boozy Bros. Today, we're gonna be exploring this abandoned armory. I have Miranda with me and we're just gonna explore this place and conduct a quick investigation. So my thing is, um, every time I go out and I explore these haunted places, it seems like a lot of times their energy is drained and a lot of these ghosts aren't able to respond. So I wonder if they will be able to in a totally abandoned place that isn't technically investigated a lot. So we're gonna see what happens. Let's go. How are you feeling? Do you feel creeped out? A little bit. This place is wildly huge. Look at that. Oh my god. Just scared the hell out of me. Oh my god. I can literally go through the freaking floor. Oh, look at all the names. Oh yeah. From 04. Okay guys, right now we're just exploring this auditorium and we're just gonna see what this place has to hold and what kind of secrets it has to offer. So stick with us, we're gonna conduct our investigation here shortly, but this place is so cool, this place is huge. I can't wait to show you. Wow, look, it just keeps going. It just keeps going, this is crazy. Oh my God, you scared me. <laughs> Straight up oh god. Okay. Uh, that looks like a crawl space. It is. There's so much more in here. Wow. That is a big hole. God, let's check out this room. Let's we'll check out this room. Are you getting any creepy vibes yet? Um, no. Earlier in one of the rooms I did, but mm -hmm. I don't hear. No. Showers. All right, I think that's the whole thing. Where'd you feel creepy at? Maybe the showers. The showers? Yeah. No way. All oh, places. Yeah. What we're gonna do is we're here in the showers. We got a creepy vibe, but what we're gonna do is perform some experiments and see maybe we can capture some paranormal activity here. So let's try it out. I got the ovulus and two EMF meters. We're gonna see if we can make something interact by calling out to it. So. Let's get started. So I'm gonna set this thing to the emotion standing. As you guys can see, whatever emotion this thing is feeling, if there is anything at all, so all I have to do is they tap, tap it and then it reacts. So let's try it out. So this is her very first time ghost hunting. We're gonna see if maybe we can capture something with it being her first time too. So let's see. We have no EMS right now. There's no electronic electromagnetic frequencies. This thing only has a three foot radius, so we'll see if this thing starts dancing by the time we're calling out to something. That's pretty much a, a yes that something's here. So uh, we're calling out to any spirits that might be here. Um, my thing just flashed a little bit. If there's anything here with us, whoa, okay. If there's anything here with us, can you, that, that certain, why did that start going off right as I started talking, right? Almost immediately. Okay, that, that's not me going crazy, but, okay. I'm curious what emotion it gave us, by the way. It gave us scared. It's scared of something. I don't know, but I did feel something in here, so. I mean, yeah, this is, this is creepy. So, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so something's here with us. You're obviously touching our devices. You're making our ovulus go off. Do you feel any kind of pain or hunger in the afterlife? If you feel pain or hunger, make these devices go off. Whoa. We have, I think we possibly have something here with us because that, that doesn't go off. I mean, you guys saw me touch that, that isn't go off for no freaking reason, and it is. What does it keep saying? Scared again. And now look, mm -hmm. this thing is going, scared, scared and what's going on. What are you afraid of? We're, please don't be afraid of us, we're not trying to hurt you. Whoa, okay. If there's any spirits here, can you please let us know of your presence by touching that device? <laughs> Whoa, okay, well. Okay guys, so we've been conducting our experiment for just a little bit. Obviously something's been 
replying to us and trying to make communication, but um, it looks like it may be getting a little irritated because we don't understand it. <laughs> I'm gonna ask, uh, if you are under 20 years old, can you hit our devices for us? Can you please make one of these set off? If, you're, if you were over 20 years old, can you t hit one of these devices? Oh, neutral. See, and it's going off with the touch setting, so this thing's being actively touched. So something is here with us. Oh wow, and our stuff's going on. Look at that. Hers is going on. Oh, mine's going on. That's crazy. Okay, so since there's something here with us touching our devices, can you please, um, Tell us the noises around us. This is crazy. There's so many noises. Where are we? I don't know. I it sounds like something's out there. It literally sounds like something's out there. It sounds like walking almost. That is not like something down there. If, if there's a spirit here with us and you want us to leave, can you please touch our device again? That's so weird. If there's still a spirit here, can you hit one of our devices or did you leave? What the heck? I like big women. Whoa. Angry. It just said angry and neutral. You said that you think it went to the other room and then it literally went angry and then neutral. What the heck? It, it was dead silent when we walked in this room. Now all of a sudden we're hearing like footsteps. We're hearing like all kinds of stuff out there. Oh, wow. This thing clearly hears us and but let's let's explore a little more and see if maybe you're right that maybe they did move around. Mm -hmm. Let's go see. As you guys can see, there's a lot of like randomness to this place. Uh, it was an armory, but it really looks like it was a school. I'll have to do some more research. All right, let's see what else we can uncover here. Whoa, okay, I'm gonna go check this out. Let's see. Whoa, okay, wish me luck. Let's see. <laughs> Look at Especially that. Especially with those stairs. Why would they why would they block this off with cinder blocks? And it's full of water. There's a oh god. Oh my god, if, if that's not haunted. Oh it's a freaking lake. It's deep. Let's check this out. Wow. Look at that inside there guys, that is nuts. <laughs> that's so cool. Getting on stage. You gonna sing? <laughs> Take it away. <laughs> Wanna do it on the stage? Let's go check it out. Okay guys, we're here in the auditorium section. We're gonna see if we can perform some more experiments for you guys. And Okay. <laughs> and see if we can get some activity because we were in there and that thing's going off now like crazy. That thing's literally going off like crazy. What the hell? Well, and her thing. Okay, so before I even get the chance to talk, it's gonna be going off. What? Okay, so obviously something's here kind of messing with us a little bit. So we're gonna see if we can communicate with it and get some answers to see why it's even here. Whoa, that thing went full red. Yeah. What? That's weird. Okay, that's, that's crazy. Okay. Did the spirit that's here, did you die here? Wow. Okay, that's that thing went off. Um, so it, I guess you didn't die here because now you're silent. You were going crazy there. Do you want to be our friend? <laughs> yes. It literally said yes. Yes again. Okay, that's creepy. Did did you go to school here? 
Yes or no? No. It's a no. Did you work in the armory? Did you live in Boynton? Look at that thing going crazy. That thing is going crazy. I don't know what mine would do. See if we're gonna have two going at the same time so that will eliminate any false positives. No, it said no. I don't even remember what I asked. I looked in Oh no. Well, maybe no to the first question, yes to the second one. No, it didn't work in the armory. Yes, it let them work. Yeah. That thing is going that's crazy. What it, yes, that's what it meant. Okay. Do you like us being here? No. It literally said no. But yes. Okay, you're giving me mixed, mixed <laughs> signals right now. So I'm just, right now, guys, we have it set to the yes and no setting. So I'm just seeing if it will respond to these questions. But it's answering pretty intelligently, honestly. This thing is answering decently intelligently. But it doesn't, it honestly doesn't seem to be very serious about communicating with us. Either it's not serious about communicating with us or it's just weak. I don't know. How do you feel? Do you feel creeped out by this thing? No, not too creeped out. Not too creeped out. I think, um, whatever it is, it's not, it's not a bad thing. It's not like a bad, whatever we're talking with. It doesn't feel negative. It feels like it's curious about us. It even says yes to that. It even says yes to that. What the heck? Yes, yes. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. Okay, guys. So we just wrapped up the investigation. We still have the ovulus running, so you might hear some beeping in the background. Because now that we're ignoring it, it seems like it's getting irritated and going off or something. I don't know. But we we experienced some kind of responses both in that shower that we were creeped out about and this place. I've been seeing if these places that we've been investigating were drained of energy and seeing if maybe a random place like this would have ghosts. And honestly, it feels pretty strong. I haven't gotten that many responses on the ovulus since the grudge house, honestly, and that was another abandoned place. I could feel something and I feel like it proved that it was here by responding pretty accurately and pretty quick. Yeah. yeah, and it's still going off. That's crazy. We're gonna have a little bit more... Oh my God, let me shut up. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude, if you're here. <laughs> This, this will just be a quick episode just to conduct our experiment, but I want to thank you for sticking around and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the like button and notification bell, all that good stuff. That way we can keep bringing you more exciting videos like this. And until next time, we'll see you later.